Okay, I'm down here with the winner of the javelin, well, the national title for the javelin throw, Hamish, who's just told me that he did everything possible to lose it. Yeah, I wasn't throwing too well today. I probably timing's been a bit out for the last few weeks. Um, I was a bit sore as well, got a few niggles, um, but still came away with the win, so that was the major goal. So. Well, well, it shows the talent of you when you can say you had it. You were a little bit off, but you can still be the national champion. So, what will you do now to tweak a few things so that when you come here in eight weeks' time, you do have great timing and you can lurch that javelin out past 80 metres, past 85 metres? Yeah, just get some quality training in. I'll, I'll be working a lot less, so uh, that'll probably help too. And um, yeah, just just a case of freshening up and getting the technique right at the right time, which is the key to major championship competing. Well, we, I mean, it's really hot here. The conditions are quite hot. You can hear how swirly it is. Were the conditions tough out there? Because obviously javelin throwers don't like the swirly wind. Uh, no, the winds weren't too bad. It was generally blowing behind us. Um, I'm not a fan of the heat and humidity being from Tassie, <laughs> but, but we've got to deal with it. So um, competitions anywhere can be in that, those sort of conditions. So, so on, that, on that point, the distance runners are all going to do acclimatisation training. As a thrower, will you look at maybe moving from Tasmania for the last little bit of your training so that you do a climb type? The calm game, the jab's in mid-April, so I don't expect it to be anywhere near as warm as this. Um, you could have the odd day that's warm. It's possible. But um, no, I'm not, I won't be doing any additional training up here other than coming up for the camp prior to the calm games and just maybe a session or two to get used to it. Well, great effort today. You've, you've ticked the box. You're on the Commonwealth Games team, so good luck. Thanks, Samson. Thank you.